Sorry I'm late, coach. Is this the basketball tryouts? What are you doing here? I want to make the team. I've been playing since I was seven. Playing with an easy bake oven? <laughs> Lunchroom's over there, chubby. But the flyer said it was open for everyone. Yeah, that's why I'm here. <laughs> All right, I'll let you make a fool of yourself. I'll put you up against our best player, Dirk. Where is he anyway? Hey, Jada, what's going on? Oh, hey, Dirk. Uh, where's Brittany? I haven't seen her around. So, do you have any plans for winter break? Oh, nothing. Just hanging out, thinking about going snowboarding. What? You're not going to the big New Year's party? No plans. Are you asking? Oh, look. Hey, guys, what are you up to? Uh, nothing. I was just talking to Jada about New Year's. Uh, New Year's? No one's asked me yet. Uh, as a matter of fact, Dirk was just... That Jada should go with my friend Trevor. Uh-huh. Hey, Coach. Sorry I'm late. So, Dirk, what do you think of these recruits? They'll be fine. I need someone to pass me the ball. Well, you know, height isn't everything. You need speed, too. And strength. You're wrong. Height matters. We'll see how fast you are. And we don't even make uniforms in your size. Get out of my gym. Coach, you should at least give him a shot. <laughs> Fine. That'll be good for a laugh. I gotta tell you something about Dirk. Why? What's wrong with Dirk? He asked me out to the New Year's party. Out? You mean like out out? Yeah. He asked me out on a date. No, that can't be right. Well, I just thought you should know. All right, you three. Let's see what you got. Dirk, show them how it's done. All right, coach. Ladies, stay seated while Dirk gives a demonstration. That's how it's done. You guys think you can keep up? Trevor, you're up. <laughs> oh, brother. I wonder if he's got a grandma that can play. All right, Trevor, that's enough. Good job. Brittany? Dirk asked me out. He what? Yes, to the New Year's party. Should I go? With Dirk? No way! Oh, why not? Because he's going with me. Oh, you should tell him then. All right, Justin, make Rebel High proud. Do you still eat with a high chair too? The basket is the little thing with the strings underneath. All right, Justin, that's it. Very nice. Hey, Brittany. Oh, hi, Alyssa. I gotta tell you something about Dirk. You mean Dirk the Jerk? Oh, are you guys not going out anymore? Huh, we'll see. Okay, all you can eat. Your turn. Lucky shot. Even a blind squirrel finds a nut every now and then. Oh, great. Breaks the rim. Okay, heavy duty, that's enough. Good work. Okay, ladies, that's enough for today. We'll be announcing tomorrow in the classroom who made the team. Okay, everybody. I'm here to announce this year's Rebel High basketball team. Oh, Some of you did a great job at tryouts. Some of you, not so much. And first up, just as if there was any doubt, we have Dirk. <laughs> Trevor, you showed some good hustle out there. Welcome to the team. And finally, Justin. You need to work on your free throws, but you'll do for now. And that's all for today. See y'all on the court. Oh, what about me, coach? Nice try, Doughboy. <laughs> we'll see you about next year.
Even though Russell scored much better than the other new players, coach won't let him on the team because of his weight. Congrats on making the team, Justin. Thanks, man. But I can't believe you didn't pick you. I know. You think Coach De Niro needs his eyes checked? I made almost every shot. No, I think you made every shot. What's Coach Zero's problem anyway? Maybe he doesn't want to embarrass his star player, Dirk. That's not right. You're a much better player than me or Trevor. The way he acts, he thinks big guys can't play basketball. Well, we need to prove him wrong. Hey, uh, sorry to bother you, Principal Anderson, uh, but Mrs. Danson said I could come in. Oh, that's fine, young man. I always have time for my students. What can I help you with? It's about Coach De Niro. I don't think he's being fair to one of the students. It wouldn't be the first time. What seems to be the problem? Well, me and my friend Russell, we tried out for the basketball team. I got on, but he didn't. You know it's up to Coach De Niro to pick the best players for his team. But you don't understand. He sunk every shot, but I missed most of mine. Look, there has to be a reason he picked you over Russell. Well, he was criticizing his weight and calling him names. Unfortunately, we've had these problems in the past. I didn't think it was happening anymore. Well, it is. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. I'll talk to the coach, and I'll get this resolved one way or another. Uh, thank you, Principal Anderson. You wanted to see me, Principal Anderson? Yes, I have some questions about this year's team. This year's team is young, but I think with some experience, they could be pretty good. Are you sure all the players are getting a fair shake? Of course. You know me. I pick all the most athletic guys. What about Russell Scott? Are you giving him a fair chance? Russell Scott? Yeah, he can shoot, but have you seen him? He's a slob. You mean his appearance? Does that affect the way he plays? It has to. He probably can't even get across the court without losing his breath. I think there's a way to find out. Yeah, there is. I'll put him through a workout he'll never forget. Better yet, let's have a free throw contest in front of the whole school. We'll find out who the best player is. Good, then we'll end this nonsense. We certainly will. The principal disagrees with the coach and is allowing Russell to prove himself in a competition. You know, a certain person hasn't asked me to New Year's yet. Yeah, I was thinking of... Well, look who it is. What do you want, Dirk? You ready for the free throw competition? I'd hate for you to be embarrassed in front of the whole school. I'm ready. Unlike you, I don't need help from Coach Baldy. Well, when you do need to practice, just remember that they have a sale on Nerf basketballs down at Target. You should know. Your shooting style is so soft. <laughs> Why are you so rude to him? He's trying to get on my team. You mean the Rebels team? I'm the captain. Well, he still hasn't asked me to the New Year's party. Well, no one's asked me either. You know who you should go with. Don't tell me. Let me guess. Trevor? Yeah, that's what Dirk said. I'm not so sure about that. Well, let me tell you something. I think he has a crush on you. Really? Trevor, you think so? Well, yeah. Who else would it be? The answer is yes. Really? <laughs> We're going to have a great time at New Year's. <laughs> <gasps> I can't wait to tell Brittany. And I can't wait to tell Dirk. Oh, about that. About Dirk? What's wrong with Dirk? Oh, well, he kind of asked me to New Year's. Really? Does Brittany know about this? I don't know. Why don't you ask her yourself? Hey guys, have you seen Dirk around? No. Good. Have you heard the news? What news? What good? You tell me first and I'll tell you second. Trevor and I are going to New Year's together. Now it's your turn. Well, Dirk and I are not. Really? Does Dirk know yet? Well, probably since he never asked me. Hey babe, there you are. Don't hey babe me. Uh, can you help me check the air in my tires? Yes. <laughs> What did I do? It's not what you did, it's what you didn't do. What did I didn't do? 
Well, if you don't understand it, I'm not explaining it to you. Yeah, I understand it. What's wrong again? Let's just say we are not going to the New Year's party together. Fine, we'll do something else. You don't understand. I only want to date nice guys. I am a nice guy. I saw the way you treated Russell. Russell wants to be on the basketball team. I mean, look at him. He doesn't compare to me. You know what? You're right. He doesn't compare to you. I told you so. He's much better than you are. Hey, babe. There you are. And we're going to the New Year's party together. <laughs> You're going to lose that free throw competition. Brittany dumped Dirk for Russell. Will Dirk get his revenge against Russell on the court? Attention, school. The principal has asked me to conduct a free throw competition today. This is where Dirk, our team captain, will compete against three new recruits to see who's the best in the school. Obviously, we know who the best is, except for one person, Principal Anderson. For our first pairing, we're gonna have Dirk eliminate, I mean compete against freshman Justin. Yes! Go get him, Dirk! Oh, poor kid. Yeah. Mm, Mr. Automatic. Oh, oh want to call your mom? Mm, two points. And denied! And next up, two newbies. Trevor and Russell. Okay, Trevor, be the basket. Ah! Rats, I mean, good basket, Russell. Yes, you got this. Yeah. Okay, you can get past this. It's okay, Trevor, it's not over. Oh. What? Are you kidding me? All right, time for the playoff. Our final competition is between our champion, Dirk, and this new kid, Russell. Way to go, Dirk. Yellow. Lucky shot for a rookie. <laughs> That's it. That's my guy. OK, Dirk. Show him your stuff. Way to go, Dirk. You got this, Dirk. Looks like we're going into overtime in this competition. This guy is out. Coach, he blocks me. That's not fair. Life isn't fair. Be a man. Well, everybody, it looks like Russell is our new champion and the new team captain. Woohoo! Yeah! Yeah, I told y'all! Yeah! Woohoo! Yeah! Russell beat out the competition and proved that talent is more important than looks. Remember, never judge a book by its cover.